done. You know, I've never had a cavity at all, ever. You know, my nutritional choices are really good choices. My diet is really good. Uh, I'm hypoglycemic, so, you know, I can eat a lot of sugar and never get a fucking cavity. This person that's been hitting me in the teeth, and then these people that had grabbed me and physically and violently damaged my teeth, every one of them faces the death penalty. Make sure everybody sees my picture of my teeth before they had damaged them. You know, my teeth has been seen in Oscar films, uh, music videos, uh, modeling, and American Dentist Association, and it's been seen in ballets. My smile has. It's even been in movies in Indianapolis, too. In reference to when they held me hostage here, or when I was in uh, the diving in water movie, the swimming movie, and other movies in other cities and states, Chicago, and other places. You know, so in reference to the film industry, my teeth are copywritten and documented too. So, you know, in reference to music or musicals or singing, Italian music, American music, or any type of music, or, you know, ballet performances, tap dance performances, you know, these people damaging my teeth, they have to get prosecuted. I want you to name one person that you can think of, or you people that have been doing this shit, hitting me in the teeth, we need you to name one person that ever had a cavity of my DNA type or of my race of DNA. Name one. My parents never had a cavity. My grandparents never had a cavity. I've never had a cavity. You've been frying and torturing and bleeding my mouth for over 22 years. We need the person in court that has been doing these things. Do you not think that's assault and battery? You don't think that's mutilation? Need you to step into court, motherfucker. You've been torturing me for over 8,000 fucking days, hitting me in the mouth and teeth. You need to show up in court with your evidence. You present somebody else's dental records, you can get the death penalty. My identity and my medical information is documented. My identity is the number one documented identity in media history in America too. It's on TV 24 hours a day. Birthmarks, beauty marks, and scars. My teeth are documented too. They're still hitting me right here. And they've been hitting me across the upper lip. I want you to explain what the fuck that is. Because that's not a crest or a symbol of my parents or family royal history. You can't put your markings on me. They can kill you for trying to put your markings on my body, government man. You don't own me. You don't own first world country people, motherfucker. You don't own anybody Italian or French or Asian or Greek or Jewish or Catholic. You need to explain yourself why you're playing your game. You claimed you own more land than my grandparents and mother and father? That's what you're trying to claim, right? You're, you're trying to claim that you own more land in America? You claimed you were richer than my parents, right? Is what you claimed? You claimed you were, you had better genetics, right? You claimed you had better teeth than my parents or something. My teeth looked exactly like my mother and father's teeth. The in-between of my mother and father, you know. They both had 100% perfect teeth. So did my grandparents, too. Need you to explain why you thought you would hit somebody in the mouth to try to make them have to bitch and complain. Why you would attack a person and rape a person and then fucking up their teeth trying to call them trash when you're the rapist. You're the person raping people. You are the trash, dirty, sick motherfucker. You better quit hitting me in the teeth. I'm not your race and I'm not your religion and you have to be charged with racism. And if you ever make up false accusations against me, you can be put on trial for the death penalty. I'm not going to play your shit, motherfucker. Do you understand that? Do you understand that, government man? Do you understand that? You better watch it. I've had lifelong scars from the government when I was little. Nobody in my race or my family history had ever lost any teeth. Nobody in my family history of genetics either. We need you to show up in court and name one fucking person 
We want you to, to say what you think my DNA type is, too. If you get it wrong, what my DNA is, they should kill you. They should put you on trial for the death penalty. For some reason, you thought you could just make up lies and change the identity of a person. You thought you could just break people's body parts and claim that you thought you were doing it for your people. And your people don't own what I'm the owner of. Your race don't own what I'm the owner of. And neither does your religion. You seem to think that you thought that you could just say shit and make up shit under the policies of America where you are misrepresenting the policies of America and you're disrespecting the court system. This is an ongoing court case and you're still abusing me even when there's been court proceedings that have been going on for what, over 22 years? Over 30 years? And you still have been hitting me in the face and teeth and your people even raped me when I've had injuries? Still have a shoulder injury and an arm injury. Still have teeth injuries. And your government men had raped me when I had teeth injuries? You get put on trial for life in prison or the death penalty. You are violating my anatomy. And they have to have, at the records department in America, they need all the names of individuals that raped me. And they need the name of the man that's been damaging my teeth and hitting me in the face and teeth. I'm not your race. You weren't richer than my parents. You have no power and no ground to stand on in this country, motherfucker. You better remember that. You can get your ass killed or put on trial for the death penalty, motherfucker, for trying to murder me and trying to steal my family wealth and history.